Hi, this is Kavita Suresh Kumar and in this video I am going to demonstrate how to create and delete PubSub topics and subscriptions in GCP using GCP console. I have logged into my Google Cloud account. Let's search for PubSub. Click PubSub. PubSub is primarily used for asynchronous communication. A publisher will publish a message to a specific topic and the message will, rem will be remain attached to the topic and the subscriber will subscribe to the topic and they will either using the pull or push mechanism receive that message from that particular topic. So for that first we need to create a topic. Let's create a topic. So let's create a topic the name demo topic. So here we have an option to add a default subscription. So let's create a default subscription with this topic and then we have an option to use a schema. If you use a schema, the publisher will be able to publish only the published messages only adhering to that schema and we will be able to enable message retention. Let's enable the message retention. So by default is seven days. I'll just put it as one day. So when you enable the message retention, we will be able to replay the messages and check. And then we are going to use the encryption as the Google manage encryption key. And even if the customer has a managed encryption key, that also will be able to use it. Now click create. The demo topic as well as the default subscription is getting created. Okay, the topic and the subscription have been created successfully. Right now we will be able to test and check go to messages so we, we are going to publish a message and we are going to pull the message from the particular subscription right so publish a message we give the message as test message right and then if you want ordering you will be able to specify the ordering key so we are not going to do that click publish the message has been successfully published now we will be able to pull the message click pull we were able to successfully pull the message so we could see this is the message which we published the acknowledgement deadline is 10 seconds so if you want to acknowledge it we should acknowledge before 10 seconds and for acknowledging we need to first enable acknowledge messages then again we need to pull this so we have pulled the message now we are able to we can acknowledge so once we acknowledge the message disappears from here okay let's go to the subscriptions click the subscription go to the messages so now when you pull the message you won't find any message because we have already processed the message and acknowledged it okay so no message found because we have already processed the message and acknowledged it now let us create one more subscription click subscriptions create subscription we'll call it as demo topic sub one and the pub sub topic is obviously the demo topic and here we have multiple delivery type options available pull that is what we used with the default subscription even you will be able to use push so in that case you need to specify an endpoint url and whenever a message is published to the topic this endpoint url will be invoked and then you have an option write to a big query and also we have an option to write to a cloud storage you will be able to give all these information so we will go with the default delivery type as pull and the message retention is seven days so you'll we can enable enable and say that retain acknowledge messages also right and then the expiration period 31 days and you can have it set up to 365 days or even you'll be able to set it never expires and the acknowledgement deadline is 300 seconds right and even if you wanted to deliver exactly once you'll be able to enable that and if you want any message ordering you can do that and you can enable dead lettering in case if the delivery attempts fails the message will be published to the dead letter topic and the retry policy either you can have as a retry immediately or retry after exponential back of delay click create 
so the subscription has been successfully added so this is the subscription details so now let us go to the topic and publish few messages before that i'm going to open the subscription in a new tab similarly the subscription also in a new tab and let's go to the topic and let's see what are the other options available from here you will be able to create a subscription create a snapshot so let's go to the topic edit messages let's select a subscription and then click publish message let's publish three messages we put this first test message edit publish publish message second test message publish create publish message okay third test message we have published three messages so let's review them okay then click pull see all the three messages now let's go to the other subscription go to messages click pull we could see all the three messages here as well right so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to acknowledge, enable acknowledge, and then pull. So I'm acknowledging the first and the second message. Okay. So then I'm going to pull again. So now I get only the third message. Let's go here. Here also I'm going to acknowledge. So enable acknowledge messages, pull. So here I'm going to acknowledge the third message and then I click pull and here we have an option for creating snapshots. Let's create one snapshot to capture the message acknowledgement state of a subscription at any given point of time. Right. So let's select the top default subscription and we give a snapshot ID one create. Okay, a new snapshot has been created. Let's create one more snapshot for the other subscription. Sub one snapshot to create. Now we have created two snapshots. Okay, let's go to the subscriptions. It will go to the sub one. Okay, go to the messages enable acknowledge messages and pull the messages okay we could see with the message remaining okay now let's acknowledge the messages click replay messages okay seek to a snapshot so we have the snapshot to click see okay so now we are able to see the messages back so this we got it from the snapshot Go to the metrics so you will be able to see the various metrics here delivery metrics acknowledgement and message count all these metrics and then you click health you will be able to see the health related information in here and when you go to retention it gives that information as well and pull it will give the information on the pull acknowledgement request right and then you can go to the details so it gives the information about the delivery type and the subscription expiry acknowledgement and deadline right message retention topic message retention duration so all this information you'll be able to see the details now if you wanted to modify anything you can click edit and then you'll be able to change here right change and again to one then you will be able to update the subscription the subscription has been edited successfully now let's go and delete this subscription delete subscription has been successfully deleted let's go and delete the other subscription also okay now let us go and delete the topic delete you need to type delete here 
topic called sarah has been successfully deleted in this demo we have seen how to create a pub sub topic how to create pub sub subscriptions and then publish messages to the topic and pull the messages from the topic using the subscriptions and also we created a snapshot and then we replayed the messages if you like this demo please do like share and subscribe thanks for watching the demo